folks? Okay. Can I have a bit more? I mean, I'm pretty exhausted. All right, a bit more? Yes. Okay. I'm almost ready for a cup of coffee. Now I want to do something entirely different, and I, I'm sort of skating on thin ice. And this is a Monty Python, now for something completely different. Yeah, I think you're totally a bit of junkie sometimes. So. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, you started me with this. Splitting the Eden Poem. Did you say this to me in Fougere at some stage? Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah. So maybe you know all this stuff I'm doing for any of it. I sort of took, I do take some of the things you used to say seriously. Yeah, really yeah. Like that. Yeah, even what Fred says. Even what Fred says. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Fred. You're, no, you're never going to forgive me no. for that comment. <laughs> no, I once said in a seminar, that, look, even Freddie understands that. <laughs> 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 It was about physics, you know, I'm yeah. sorry, Fred. <coughs> now, what have we done with marginals? We've actually integrated over P to get X, or we integrate over X to get P. You have to get everything expressed in terms of P. So, can, and, and the, the idempotent, and the density matrix is both of these. It's got a function of X and P and X and P. You know, I'm trying to motivate something here with that in the rigorous. We, we as physicists write the density operator in a pure state as just from Keck. Sorry, Keck bra. And so what I did in my in the work that I presented in, in lecture was to pull 